week into the project of converting this room into office for Sophia and ultimately our bedroom. We've done all the plasterboards on all the walls that we can do, apart from the wall behind the camera, which we can't really do until we have the windows. They're at least 30 years old, I think, and they don't stand up to the um, modern standards of windows anymore. Double glazed uh, up here in northern Sweden. It's very normal to have triple glazed windows these days. So whilst we can't continue with that and finishing the plasterboard on one wall and a small section of the ceiling, just in case we have to redo some of the framing, I didn't want to have it all covered up and have to pull it back down again, so we, we left that open for now. What we're going to continue with today, and I've never done this before, so this is going to be um, interesting. Well, I wouldn't call it plastering. Fill in all the gaps between the different panels and hide out all the screws in the different boards so that we basically have a nice, flush, even surface which we can then paint. So we're in uh, Sophia's closet. I've done the first coat of um, um, plaster. So as you can see, it needs it needs a bit of um, sanding. It's quite rough in places. I never plastered in my life, so it's uh, a little bit of a process to get right. It took me a few attempts to get a bit of a system going, but I think I've figured it out now. So um, hopefully the rest will be easier. finished the first room yet and Saf's already taken the next room apart. <laughs> Stripping the upstairs kitchen to I bits. only like destroying. I don't like building. Oh. <laughs> well, somebody has to do it. Yeah, you do it. Do you want to smash that cabinet off the... Off the... Like this? Yeah, just smash it off. <laughs> Harder. Well, that's it. Oh, that's the handle. Oh, yeah. oh yes! Oh my god, this is good. I wish, I wish I met somebody. Oh! I told you, this is a, a great stress relief. Ow! Careful, don't hurt yourself. <laughs> you were checking it out. Hit that. Oh, that's good. I hope there was nobody downstairs. Thank you. 
consistently 28 degrees uh, C here for the last couple of days so the, um, the plaster is drying quickly but because in the corners there is quite a, a, a thick build up of it I'm probably not doing it right either which doesn't help it um, which means it takes a lot longer to dry so while sanding it today I actually uh, clogged up the sander um, the sandpaper and so I have to swap that out decided to leave those corners for what they are.